Give me a minute. Sheldon. Hold on. I need to figure out how to get the bucket so I can carry the mud past the dragon. Sheldon, you need to work in the morning. I know. Well, then bed, mister. Five more minutes. Really? You're gonna risk getting sleepy in the middle of your thermodynamic fluctuation seminar? You know what happens when you yawn in public? Everyone will see my oddly shaped uvula. You don't want that, do you? No. But it's a shame our society mocks the differently uvulated. <laughs> Who was at the door? A uh, building manager. Uh, they have to fix a pipe, so uh, the water will be off tomorrow from noon to two. That's unacceptable. We're supposed to be given written notice. No, no, it doesn't matter. We'll be at work. What if I spill tomato soup on my shirt and have to come home to change, only to find there's no water for an enzyme soak? Bifurcated uvula, Sheldon. I'll have the chicken noodle. Good night. <laughs> We're gonna have to be very quiet. I know how to get the bucket. I can turn the axe around and use the handle to reach it. Let's see. Go north. You are in a forest. Go north. You are in a forest. Go north. You are in a forest. Oh dear, I believe I'm lost. Well, I'll just have to get a fresh start tomorrow. No, 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 no. You just, you, you, just, you just need to map it out. Come on, I'll help you. So uh, you stopped at this stream and you turned north three times? Yes. Uh, you're right, you're lost. Good luck. <laughs> Hi, Howard. Hi, Sheldon. Hello. Hey. Why are you holding hands? I forbid you to hold hands. <laughs> Rajesh, you know Leonard and I spent the night together. Yeah, but you were just sleeping because I forbade you to have sex. <laughs> the word is forbade. You sure? That doesn't sound right. <laughs> Listen, Rajesh, Leonard and I have decided to see each other again. And you don't get to tell me who I can and can't have a relationship with. Uh, actually, he can. The Hindu code of Manu is very clear in these matters. <laughs> If a woman's father is not around, the duty of controlling her base desires falls to the closest male member of her family, in this case, Raj. The code also states that if she disobeys, she will be reborn in the womb of a jackal and tormented by diseases. <laughs> if true, that seems like an awfully large gamble, given that the prize is Leonard. <laughs> There it is, Priya. We're Indian. We believe this stuff. I think it also says that if you eat beef, you need to live with cows for three months and drink their urine. Some of it makes sense. Some of it's crazy. My point is... You have such beautiful eyes. You ever thought about getting contacts? I tried in the seventh grade. I could never get used to them. Oh, that's too bad. Yeah. If I had contacts, I would have been the coolest debate club president ever to be stuffed into his own cello case. <laughs> If you had them on now, you could see what we're going to do next. Mm. That, that, that's okay. I can infer from context. Check it out. It's got contacts. <laughs> We need to talk about something. Oh my God, you're breaking up with me. Why would you take me out shopping and then break up with me? That is so cruel. Leonard, I'm not breaking up with you. Oh, okay. <laughs> so what's up? It's a little weird, your ex-girlfriend hanging out here all the time. I know, I usually never see my ex-girlfriends, unless their hard drives crash. <laughs> I'm just saying, how would you feel if I was hanging out with my ex-boyfriend? Mm, not great, I guess, but Penny and I are just friends. I don't care. This is a woman you have slept with. If you want her around, then I have to wonder if maybe you're not ready to move on. No, 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 I'm ready. I, I gave up the gift of sight for you. If that's not moving on, what is? <laughs> you need to cut the cord with Penny. Oh, okay.
You don't sound very confident. No, no, I'm confident. It's not like I'm unfamiliar with the get lost conversation, although this will be the first time I'll be the one saying it. <laughs> Thank you. Mm. I appreciate it. Sure. Oh, God, you smell so good. <laughs> of course, that could just be my other senses getting stronger. <laughs> um, okay, tell Bernadette to tell Priya that I'm on my way to Prague to shoot a movie with Angelina Jolie. Got it. Is it gonna be in 3D? <laughs> what? I don't know, it doesn't matter. I'm gonna say 3D. That'll let her know the studio has faith in it. You're kidding, 3D? That's what I hear. Well, the studio must have real faith in it. <laughs> oh, why she didn't tell me? Have you been spending time with your ex-girlfriend? No. <laughs> Then why are you surprised she didn't tell you? Well, uh, it's not as much a surprise as, uh, 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 you, you know, uh, the, the, the other thing. What other thing? Well, uh, you know, if, if, uh, if you, uh... <laughs> I don't... Uh, oh, what's the word I'm looking for? I'm not gonna help you. This is hilarious. <laughs> I wanna see if we can find the cafeteria and get real coffee? Sure. We're going to the cafeteria to get some coffee. You want anything? Uh, I'm fine. It's nice that they're getting along. Your girlfriend and your ex-girlfriend are hanging out together? Well, yeah. That can only be good for you. <laughs> what are you talking about? One of them broke up with you. Do you really want her telling the other one why? <laughs> I don't care. I don't have anything to hide. Good. Good. Then you have nothing to worry about. <laughs> no. I do not. You are a mean little man. <laughs> You'd think it'd be because my parents didn't love me, but actually they loved me a great deal. <laughs> God, that is so true. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> what took you guys so long? Oh, we were just chatting. That's nice, what about? We were just comparing notes about how you are in the sack. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. <laughs> What if she wasn't kidding? Doesn't matter. I'm the king of foreplay. <laughs> oh, God, I feel ridiculous in this dress. You look beautiful, Lieutenant O'Hara. <laughs> now prepare for inspection. <laughs> My brother's going to hear you. Oh, relax, he's got headphones on, and we're 10 miles above Earth in a starship. Really? 10 miles? You're orbiting inside the atmosphere? Moron. I can't believe I'm wearing my brother's Halloween costume. I can't believe you think he only wears it on Halloween. <laughs> Open the landing bay doors, shuttlecraft approaching. Okay, gotta go. So here we are, back in bed together. Yep, here we are. <clears throat> okay, so I, I, I guess I'll just jump right in. All right. You're a naughty girl. <laughs> and I, and I, I, I want to punish you with my love. What? <laughs> Not good. That's terrible. Try again. OK, uh, 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 you're not naughty. Uh, you're, you're, you're dirty. You're... <laughs> You're a, a, a dirty girl? Oh, yes. Yes, I am. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, okay, you're, uh, you're, uh, you're a, 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 a dirty, disgusting, revolting girl. <laughs> God, Leonard, stop talking. What are you, just give me five minutes. I'll Google how to do this. I'll call you right back. <laughs> Just be quiet and do what I tell you. Okay, like usual, good. <laughs> Take off your shirt. All righty. Shirt coming off. Ta-da, man nipples. <laughs> I said be quiet. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> now take off your shorts. Taking shorts off. There we go. 
Naked, naked, naked. <laughs> Wonderful. Now I'll take off my clothes. Cool. <laughs> Damn it! Oh, Leonard, already! No, 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 no! The, the screen froze. It's probably just buffering. Just give it a second. Fine. <laughs> so, how are your mom and dad? Yeah, I really don't want to talk about my parents now. Yeah, sure, sure. If your video's frozen, try resetting the TCP IP stack. Oh! I didn't even think of that, thanks! You're welcome. Please let me know when you and your girlfriend are done hogging the bandwidth for your self-abuse. I'm trying to stream a movie on Netflix in here. How's it going? Uh, not so good. We have to talk. Oh, sounds serious. What's up? Okay, uh, here it is. I met this girl, and I kissed her, and I feel terrible about it, but it's done, it's never gonna happen again, and I am so, so sorry. No, no, relax, it's okay. It is? Ah, oh, these things happen. They happen to everybody. Oh my God, you are amazing. I mean, I don't deserve you. What do you, what do you mean, everybody? <laughs> Leonard, I didn't know if I should tell you, but I kind of cheated on you, too. I kind of? A couple of weeks ago, I slept with my ex-boyfriend. So I guess we both messed up a little. No, no, I messed up a little. You messed up a lot. Well, it's not a competition. Oh, yeah, it is, and you won.